Welcome back on the Gucci Mercer. Coming to you live from Japan. We're coming to you live from Japan. <laughs> And we're gonna eat a bunch of Japanese snacks that Josh bought. And I don't have my bandana, so today I'm wearing toilet paper with the uh, writing. What does it say? Tamago. Eggs and tamago, please. Eggs, please. Oh, eggs. that's oh, it is eggs. It just says egg. Okay, all right. We're now the best duo. Molly has been fired. Goodbye. This is Jetty. Ed. J job. J Jetty. Which one do you like better? Post in the comments. Yeah. I like Jetty. Come up with a team name for us. Uh, which one do you want to start with, dude? You pick and I'll get the translator. Okay, I'm going to close my eyes. Whoa, hey there. <laughs> Before we continue this hilarious and riveting video, allow me to introduce today's sponsor, Sleeper. Sleeper is the fastest growing fantasy platform in the world. Sleeper has every sport covered. It currently boasts over 6 million users and offers unique chat and community features that other apps don't offer. And as for Bracket Mania, Sleeper has changed the game. Remember how March Madness brackets used to go down, you hop into a pool, make your picks, and that was pretty much it. No trash talk, no friendly banter. Well, Sleeper saw that and they thought, let's spice things up. Sleeper added a whole new dimension with in-game chatting and customizable scoring. So now it's not just about picking winners. It's about the thrill of dropping the perfect gift when your underdog team makes it to the Sweet 16. So if you're tired of the same old fantasy games where the biggest thrill is just hitting submit, give Sleeper a shot. It's where the community is buzzing and where fantasy sports has become more than just about numbers. And let's face it, who doesn't want to be the hero of that group chat. Download Sleeper, check it out, it's a lot of fun. Go ahead and follow the link in the description and join my Bracket Mania group. Follow my picks on Sleeper. We can make some memories together. Check out Sleeper today. This one. Ooh, I've been really keen for that one. It's weird looking because it looks like a Cornetto. A what? Okay, that's an Australian thing. It looks like an Australian ice cream. Caplico, giant Caplico. Ichiko, contains strawberry flavoring. The thing I love about Japanese is that everything is so conveniently packaged. It's like an idiot proof. It's literally it you buy a sandwich and it's like, start by pulling this tab. Not so idiot proof because I was about to open it from the top until you said something. No, nah, well, that's what happens. <laughs> What the hell is that? That looks like ice cream. It's hard. Is it? What the f***? It's like a stale marshmallow. But this is softer than this. All right, go ahead. You mm. take the first bite. That's weird. Oh! Mmm! <laughs> I knew this was gonna happen. It's like strawberry white chocolate and then chocolate on the inside. Mmm. You crafty Japanese people. <laughs> first anime and floating trains and now this shit. <laughs> That's how I eat my ice cream cones. Do you ever eat them like this? You're a f***ing monster. You're oh, been more of a menace if you eat your ice cream like this. Yeah, that's f***ing weird, man. What the f***? What are you handing me? It's literally just dumping shit all over me in this beautiful Japanese house. What else do we got? Oh, there's a shrimp. I rate that pretty highly, by the way. That's actually really, really good. The kapaliko. Kapaliko. All right, your turn to pick. I picked the shrimp too. <laughs> shrimp. Onegaishimasu. It's a picture of a shrimp, onegaishimasu, by company Kalbi. What does it say? Salmon Kalbi. Um, salmon Kalbi? <laughs> sa <laughs> that's the color that Sam turned whenever Molly said something racist to me. <laughs> I feel that. That says poppy. This one says, it says poppy, and then it says plum petals are good when it comes out. <laughs> Happy <Plum> Lou. <laughs> Limited period. Oh, shit. Your girl's like, mm, sorry, we can't do anything for a week. And then a couple of days later, she's like, I'm, I'm good. good. Limited period. Limited period, yeah. yeah. <laughs> What are they though? They smell like curry spice. That's what's in this thing here. It's like a little Cheeto. Yeah. It says when the petal comes out. Yeah, what the f***? It has a picture of like a little petal thingy. Are they plum shrimp? Wait. I'm assuming that there's one little petal in there, right? There has to be. Maybe they're just talking shit, expecting idiots like me to look for a petal and it doesn't actually exist. Maybe it's like Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory where you find the plum and you get to go to like a Japanese prawn Maybe factory. that's what it is. So there's a little petal in the front. There's some text underneath. Oh it. yeah, we didn't catch that last time. Plum flower-shaped cap of shrimps in. <laughs> <laughs> Which is, okay. I could have right. told you, man, that. I would rate this like a two out of 10. You don't like it? It wouldn't be my go-to snack. It Not actually it. tastes like raw fish. Ready? There's no plum. There's no plum in there, oh, dude. Shit. It's supposed to be good when it comes out, is what it said. No lied to by the Japanese again. Fuck. Meron soda. But I've only had Burger King melon soda, so I want to see what the actual good stuff is. Pure water. Use. They're very direct with what they say. <laughs> Eat. Eat. Enjoy it. Stuff it in your nose. Do not put anything Wait, in your nose. Say that, but... mm, I love melon soda, but maybe it's because I'm a weeb. Oh, we forgot to kampai. Oh, you're chugging it. Holy f this is delicious. This is what I imagine that little kids think the dishwashing liquid tastes like when they go under the sink. <laughs> this is what Tide Pods look like they taste like. This one says nostalgic and refreshing. I remember this time when my grandpa used to give me melons. He would stuff them in my mouth and they would squish and they would 
slide all across my tongue, all the way down my throat. Yeah, maybe I'm remembering that different. It doesn't sound like what they're talking about. What do you think of melon soda? I actually, uh, I think it's tasty, but I'm not a soda guy. Okay. What the hell is this? Choco whip? Did you just buy a whip, Margo? How's that a snack? This means we have to put this on something. No. Oh my God. It's not Tostino's or whatever you call it. Here, let me- Totino's pizza rolls? Wait, we have bread. We don't have to put- Oh, oh my God. Oh, I caught it. Holy crap. <laughs> I squeezed too hard and this came out. Yeah, have you ever accidentally like ripped the toilet paper in your hand while you're wiping? Yeah. Chocolate whip. Food required. Okay, I ain't gonna lie. There's chocolate whip. Fucking delicious, dude. Is that? Absolutely, have some. Oh, what the fuck? Mm. It's good, right? It's like Nutella. All right, hold up. Let me pour some on the... I don't know about this one, man. Come on, bro. You gotta try it, try it. It says, please use on food. Required, it said. If it's illegal not to. Bro, shrimp plum things with chocolate, they go from a two out of 10 to a four out of 10. Wow, still too shit to pick from the aisle. But not shit enough for me not to lick it out of my fingers. Mm, I think this, is, this tastes exactly like Nutella. It's like hazelnut spread. Whoa, the back says a lot. You can enjoy a delicious intake of calcium, which is essential for your child's growth. Wait, are you saying that the back of this label says that this chocolate whipped cream is essential for a child's growth? Yeah. <laughs> Take that, America. Yeah, chocolate is good for kids. Oh, I see what we're doing here. Yeah. I'll tell you when to stop. Uh, I'm a good uh, I'll tell you uh, when to stop. Oh, sorry, Eddie Chan. Oh, oh, I upset tummy. Oh, oh, oh. I just hit oil. <laughs> okay, so as you can see, it looks like a dog has just taken a shit on my sandwich, but I reckon it's gonna be delishimoso. Delishimasen. Mm. I just made up a new word. Delicious, please. <laughs> What the f are you doing, bro? I made a taco. Okay, you're like fing biting it from. I don't what wanna... the f is this? That's useless. That's not even half. That's useless. I just want the straight what runnies. You... I want the straight poo. I actually just turned white bread into a chocolate filled muffin. Super bread. Super bread. 10 out of 10. That's the best thing so far. And it's an invention that we came up with. Oh my god. He's doing the king sandwich. You have a weird relationship with food, man. It's scaring me. Do you know how you don't kiss your girl in just one way? This is the way it is with food. I don't eat food in just one way. I gotta find different ways to try it and eat it and taste it. What do you mean? You like squirt Hold this up. into your girl's mouth and give her a kiss to have the chocolate kiss? Where I come from, a chocolate kiss is a different meaning. Hey, Gabby, you want a chocolate kiss? <laughs> Okay. That didn't go well. I just want to say the shrimp taco brings the shrimp up from a two to a six. That shrimp keeps getting better and better and better every time yeah, I taste it. Yeah, if you mix it. shit food with better food, it gets better. It's the law of averages, <laughs> maybe. That's an average. Sorry, it's hard to take any advice from someone with toilet paper wrapped down in his head. That says, <laughs> that says egg in Japanese. Ice cream? These ones are frozen, so we have to do them What next. is it? Here Whoa, we go. look at this. Why does that say Monaka? I don't know. Why does it say Monaka? Asuki Monaka. Asuki Monaka. Asuki Monaka. Hey, 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 hey. Monaka is a thing. So what Google Translate is telling me. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I don't know what it is. It's just Monaco. I don't know what Monaco is. Monaco is a thing. Told you. Ooh, it's okay. oh, like wafer. Wafer? Wait for me. Whoa, look, look at that. Look at that. There's there's like a bend to it. I'm doing like a f***ing flex test. And now for my bend test. Mm, yes. Oh, wow. Oh, it didn't break. I mean, it did break. <laughs> Thumbs up for that. Oh, so it's filled with ice cream and like chocolate chestnuts. Is chestnuts a chocolate or is it just a nut? Chestnut is a nut. But they mix with it with chocolate. Cheese, bro. Come on. Don't you know that? <laughs> Chest make me nut. Girlfriend and wife test. Gabby in the house, everyone. Gabby in the house. My girl on the other side of the house. Let's all try it together. I've been trying it. It's good. Hey, you didn't wait for me. Uh, I'm gonna go hey. f myself. Ice cream is so creamy here. That's so yummy. Mm, this is Abe's good. Well, I'm gonna rate this a 20 out of 10 just because I like beans. <laughs> I like and beans. there's beans in there. Mexico, you need to learn. Start making bean ice cream. What the fuck? Bean cream. I only mm. wish the wafer was crunchy. Yeah, everything's a little soggy. Dude, I thought, like, looking at it, I was like, oh, white chocolate for sure. It's not. Yeah, oh yeah, so it's red bean paste on the top like that, which is a very sweet bean. I can't finish it. There's too much more sweets. No oh, shit, you're right. I, I love red bean stuff. I love the ice cream here. And having it so you can hold it without getting your hands dirty. It's f***ing genius. Mm. All right, now get out of get here. Out of oh, here. Get out of here. Get out of here, you two. Oh my God. Josh? You can show that, but as, I'm not saying it. As a snack, I got- You're allowed to say that more than I am. Black Black Nika, mm. a bottle of Black Nika. They sell that here in Japan. They used to sell it in a... No, I'm not gonna... <laughs> <laughs> Wait! Eddie, we have like 50 more things, stop. Yeah, I know, but I don't oh, know. you're mixing the them all shrimp, together. The shrimp chocolate red bean ice cream. Eight out of 10. That went from a six to a 6.25. I think you're just hungry.
<laughs> Mario? Mario. Do you want to try the Mario ones? Yeah. It says, Mario and his friends have become gummies. Two deliciousness. Cola and melon soda flavored. This is the shape of the gummy. All seven types. If there's a gummy shape like this and the item inside, you're lucky. It seems like a couple of the snacks have special rare snacks in oh, there. Oh, that's probably what the, the, the Lotus thing was earlier. It's like the golden ticket of Wonka bars, except you don't win anything. You just feel good about yourself because you got a special item. Pretty much. It's like loot boxes in video games. Spend your money just to get an endorphin high in case you get a special item out of it and you can't do anything with this it. This is you what happens good. when you ban gambling. All the little kids have to resort to... What if you ate the rare gummy? You didn't even check. Oh, come on, buddy. Why are you That's your cola. This one's a... Oh, I got a special item! You did! You swallowed the rare one! <laughs> you f***er. I know! Oh, oh, sorry. I've got a turtle shell. Oh, there's another. I got a special item too. Oh, oh I do feel good. Mm. I got another one. Now I love gummy. I got another one. Oh, that's Yoshi. <laughs> special <laughs> items. You could probably climb a wall. I got three. You could. Oh, you got a star? I got a star. I got a shell, and I got a Yoshi egg. Spider gummy. You want to see how sticky these are? Ready for the sticky test? Mm. Ready? <laughs> Holy shit! How does he do it? I'm Spider Man. He's got the power of the secret. Oh, okay, that one's stuck there. Autistic now. Spider Man. <laughs> I want to try this. You want to shake my hand? No, I don't want to touch you anymore. Oh, man. No. <laughs> no. Go to the next one, dude. They're like yummy little rings. Crispy potatoes. Funny promotion campaign. That says poco. Means a little bit in Spanish. Okay, well, this isn't Spanish. Okay, well. Oh, there was a different way to open this. This is very sticky. <laughs> Ooh, what the hell? You're married and you're 30. <laughs> How can you adult so hard? And that, by the way, is covered in chocolate, so. It makes it funnier. <laughs> it came out with Now Gabby's laughing. I can see why he's married. This shrimp about to get an STD, bro. What the <laughs> f I'm through all of What the hell, man? These are fucking great, though. True. Oh, this one's unraveled. Someone forgot to do this up at the factory. I bet he's uh, gonna get fired for that blunder. They missed one problem with these, though. If they made him a little bit bigger to fit over the finger, then it's hours of fun. Unfortunately, they made him cock, guys. If you, if you I could just eat these all day. These are delicious. Mm, they're very light. They're thin. They're like very crunchy. I knew this was gonna happen. We put this away before we eat them all. We still have a lot of snacks to go through, but I really like those. No, stop it. Down. No, I'm in the bowl. Good boy. What are those? They look Mexican. May I? <laughs> Koshikun, may out. I eat these onigashimasu? You wouldn't eat something that you didn't know what it was. See, I would. Sea urchin crackers. Me and Margo have had sea urchin once at a restaurant and we fucking hated it. Delicious. I, we hated it. Probably had shit ones. It's hard to take any advice from you when you're mixing potato and fucking Japanese Cheetos with chocolate and bread and being like, mmm, eight out of 10 onigashimasu. You could say what you want, but I have put an entire generation of kids onto Valentina sauce on their Doritos and I get messed messages every day on Twitter saying, your combination of sauce and Doritos changed my life. I'm gonna say, you're a man of many talents, but that is the weakest flex that I've ever heard you put out. <laughs> Valentino's and Doritos sauce change lives. Mmm. They smell good. Mmm. They have nice crispiness to them and fluffy at the same time, crispy and fluffy. These are just like rice puffs with sea urchin flavor on top. Hang on, this one is a secret packet to eat as well. What is a gel packet and you fucking die? What the f is that? You want me to scan it, brother? Taste first, ask questions later. <laughs> I'm gonna scan it. Safe. That says Sakamoto. Do not eat. <laughs> it says <laughs> do not eat in giant letters. <laughs> <laughs> it has a phone number to ring if you fucking if kids eat it. Should I call them? <laughs> It's one of those um, moisture absorbing it things. It actually looks like salt. Look, it's salt. I'm not shaking on purpose. <laughs> Why the f would they put that in a packet? It looks like seasoning. The only English word it says on there. Sakamoto. And safe. Actually, in English it says safe. No shit. It actually says safe right there. How you feel? Watashi wa Eduardo kun. Suge, sumimasen. Mmm, -hmm. uh, Toilet wa doko desu ka? Oh, you had the Japanese go. No, I'm just asking where the toilet is because I have to shit now. Oh. It actually tasted like nothing. There's no taste to it. No! It says safe on there. I'm not, yeah, but it said safe in English. Maybe it's I a mistranslation. Maybe it's a mistranslation. That's seasoning. You said it tastes like nothing. True. 
Okay, we're going to the next one here, and we're keeping a close eye on your vitals. Okay. This one just has a picture of toilets. <laughs> what? And they have anime eyes. Toilet chan with anime eyes. The Mokolete Fairyland edition. No fruit juice. It will come out fluffy. Snack do? With a question mark? That's why I sort of like that. <laughs> it's gonna come out. It will come out fluffy. Somewhere in Japan, some guy has spent like a million dollars figuring out the best, most efficient way to open packaging. Okay, but watch this. And I am Beat shocked. that, Japan. I'm shook of. Well, oh. you have to build the toilet? Oh, it comes with stickers. You can customize your own toilet. Oh, that's so, so good. What if you're hungry, you just want to go out and have a little snack? You go to an actual toilet. Not, no, that's not the point I was getting at at all. This is your little toppy bit. It's oh, nice. it's even got a bidet on it. Does it squirt flavor in your mouth? I hope so. And Look, it's a toilet. It's an actual just little toilet with a little bidet on it. Moko moko powder in the top. Moko moko powder. Wait, mm. hold up. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to use some Google Translate on this shit. It's pictures. What do you need to translate for? Because it has instructions under the pictures. Open the lid of tank and put one fluffy bag in it. Gently tap the container two or three times to make the powder reach the bottom. And then use tank lid. Pour two cups of water. Wait, two cups of water? Okay, I think it means just two of these of water. I feel like I'm just putting like toilet washing detergent in. Let's put both of these in, I reckon. I can't believe I'm about to eat candy out of a toilet. It's not the first time though. Let's put this one in too. Okay, now two, two. Does it come with a straw? Yeah, because you drink it out of it or some shit. Wait, can we put eyes on it? Oh, this one comes with the monster eyes. Yeah, yeah you can actually like make your little toilet. Yeah. Yeah, customized super kawaii toilet. He said we put two of these things in because two cups won't fit in there, so. Why don't you just dip that thing in the cup of water? Oh, wait, that seems much smarter. <laughs> okay, it's not working. <laughs> okay, one. Two. And then what happens? Whoa, it's fizzing up. Is it? Oh, it's, it's actually coming up. Yeah, it's actually coming up. It's a backed up toilet. Oh shit. It's filling. It's, don't do that. It's filling. It's, a shrimp is coming out. Oh my God, I don't remember eating that. My shrimp's now a seven, my guy. <laughs> Shut up. How the f are you gonna walk around in public drinking out of this toilet though? Konnichiwa. 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 How is it? actually tastes like detergent. Really? That tastes worse than the fucking packets I'm not supposed to eat. Wait, I don't know about that one. And the more you drink of it, the more it keeps coming ah, out. Ah, the melon soda made it worse. It's all fucking fizzy in the back of my throat now. So you drink the toilet bowl out and then it starts filling again. What? The infinite toilet snack. That's how it is actually. If you flush the toilet, it just keeps filling up with water and you have an infinite drinking source. <laughs> Not worth the effort, that I'm was, not gonna lie. Yeah. That's probably the worst one. I said before I haven't had like any terrible Japanese snacks, but I, I put that in Pace the category. Sherbet. I put that in like terrible category. Pretty category. gay, yeah. Sours. Sour. Sour. Yeah, it's, it looks like what are these? They look like little sugar gummies and they're turtle shaped by the looks of it. Two textures in one grain. Crab crab food. Kamehame. Sours. Gummy. Sours gummies. Muscat flavor. Kamehame. Kam Kamehameha. What is that? Turtle turtle sour? No, it's the turtle beam because it's from Kame who wears the turtle. Nuh uh. Yeah, he's the turtle man. It's just a big shout from a turtle man? Well, think about ha! it. When he goes to the Kame house, the old man, he has the turtle. It's the turtle house. Please open from here. Sour pa <laughs> You didn't know that? I thought you'd know that. In Japanese, it means turtle destruction wave. Oh, maybe I should open this like Eddie. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. No. What? Come on, it's not man. What the Japanese want? I don't care what the Japanese want. I bought this from them. <laughs> Look at the little turtle. <laughs> they are adorable. Cool. It's like a perfect little turtle. Don't drink the turtle, but <laughs> I'm trying to That's see. the wrong end to drink the it's turtle. It's actually wet. Why is the turtle wet? I really like these. You just bit all of his legs off. <laughs> you turned him into a kame nugget. No, now it's just a turt. No, ma'am. You're killing the turtle. No! I like them. <clears throat> okay, how about shrimp and turtle? I don't know about that one, Chief. Yeah. Where did that ranking end up? At that, average down? Does shrimp have come down to a three now? Yeah, I would imagine so. Fuck. What the f is this? Is this just corn mayo spread? Acorn and man, baked or as is. Acorn and man? Oh, no, it's corn and mayo. Sorry, it mistranslated. No longer does corn and mayo need to be prepared separately and then combined into one delicious treat. Now we have it in one. Yes. It's just corn kernels and fucking mayonnaise. Corn and mayo, that's just like what we put on our corn on the cob. What the f it just came out. It just came out. Bro, <laughs> what the fuck? Whoa, it's literally entire corn kernels and mayonnaise. Man, that is glorious. Glorious. Mm. Oh, we're moving to this country. 
That's one of the best things I've ever tried. We do this in Mexico. If you just take a cup of corn kernels, put mayonnaise in it, some salsa valentina, and a little bit of tahini mm. on top, a little bit of uh, lemon, mm, you get your whole cup of goodness. That's I love my new this. favorite thing. This tastes like home. You've been drinking we out of a toilet. Like, I know, but okay. the corn. You drank out of a toilet and you said this tastes like home. <laughs> Not the toilet, the corn does. Okay, okay. I was scared, but now I'm happy. Oh, the toilet's filled up more. No, incorrect. Oh, bro, that is not a good move. Oh, there's corn stuck in your sherbet straw. Ozamashi, brother. Shito, shito. <laughs> These are viral on TikTok. That's the only reason we bought them. And it's the Japanese police are here. <laughs> I've been drinking out of a toilet. I've been committing sins. Okay, these are very popular on TikTok. That's why we bought them. It literally just says on here, strawberries, custom, and whipped cream in a sandwich. A sandwich? Specifically says a way to open it. Do it like that. I fucking love the way Japanese And then you, you open them like that, okay? They already cut the crust off for you. So you don't have to be a little bit about it. Like this country is just like having a mum look after you. <laughs> it actually is. Look at that shit right there. Japan is my mom and I am a spoiled child. This is like basically a cake. I taste good. Yeah. <laughs> it's really good. Mmm. It's very light and fluffy. That's delicious. Mm-hmm. You think maybe you might have rushed that one a little bit and savored the flavors? I could I could I could save some for later. Mm. I just put that there for now. Okay, Wait. I, don't, I don't eat mine anymore. Are you sure? Can I have it? <laughs> Why are you mixing the thing you hated the most with all the other shit? Why don't you pick something you like and mix it with something good? I believe in the shrimp, dude. That oh. shrimp's gone from a four to a five again. Forget the shrimp. I the can't shrimp's forget done. the shrimp. The shrimp was the first thing. The shrimp f me. It was supposed to have a lotus. F the shrimp. All right, what's next? That's the end step. F the shrimp. Yes. Oh man. This one's just got a picture of a baby on it. So I'm assuming it's baby flavored. Probably from China then. Yeah, that doesn't look like Japanese. No. Here we go. Let's see what it does. Obese milk. <laughs> Strawberry. <laughs> Wrapped in mochi dough made from sea office milk. What the f is the sea office? And why are they making milk? A bunch of little sea otters are sitting there milking the female sea otters, getting some f milk for these. You ever had sea otter milk? Gabby, can you ring that poison hotline? I don't think you're supposed to eat them warm. Oh, what the f It's filled with f***ing goo. <laughs> now you got goo all over you. So it's a mochi ball, and if you haven't had mochi, it's kind of like uncooked dough. It is, isn't it? Yeah, so it's kind of stretchy, and it's really fluffy, and this one's obviously filled with jelly. Mine was a pouch. Look, you just if you turn it inside <laughs> out, it's white. You ever got one of them little sticky hands out of the, out of the vending machine? Bro. Stop hitting me with your f***ing baby goo. <laughs> That's actually nice. I like that. <laughs> Why are you looking at you me? You just like, mushed it in your hand. And you're like, mm, yeah, that's pretty good. Tastes good. Try that one next. The this green one? thing. This looks like a packet of tea. What is it? It's chocolate. 18 pieces of it, apparently. No, you're not touching anything anymore. After this, you're having a bath. <laughs> I'm wearing fucking toilet paper on my head, dude. I don't think I'm having a bath today. A combination of richly scented shine muscat and rich white chocolate. Enjoy the marriage of elegantly melting chocolate and fresh shine muscat. Oh, it's got alcohol in it. Can we put some black Nika on it? Oh, you wanna be careful we don't mispronounce that one. Sorry, brother, I'm just saying what the bottle says. Yeah, I know, I know. Just everyone watching, black N-word. Nika in Japanese, I think means sun god. <laughs> Please. Nika, please. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I'm asking. Nice. Nika, please. Nice. No, bro. Oh, you put I'm, your hand out. I wasn't just saying it as a joke. I'm saying, can I have some Nika, please? Oh, you actually were. Okay, are you sure you want me to hold on to no, this? No, don't touch it. Man, give me that shit, bro. Oh, you're going to lose a tooth, man. One of them was wobbling when you did that. Oh my god. Ow, that actually hurt my teeth. They're in like little gold packaging. Shine! Isn't shine in Japanese mean die? Like when you're telling someone die? Die chocolate. Die, muscat! Oh, it hit me, bro. It tastes like lychee. It's like grape chocolate. That's lit, I like white chocolate. Do you have something against dark chocolate? No, I've been drinking that stuff all day. I like how you pause before stuff. <laughs> I like- Something about this bottle is making you a little bit nervous. I mispronounced one letter in that word. I'm going away into YouTube jail. Is this thing too? Oh, what the f is that? Open that, one, open that one, open that one, open that one, open that one. Okay, I'm getting it. I wanna try it, man. This one says, two kinds of peach pie fruit, luxury sweet pie. Peach, enjoy, or the squirrel will eat. The photo is an image of the taste. Uses civilian putter. <laughs> when you're really high and you can see tastes and smell colors. This image is a visualization of the taste. <laughs> yeah, I really know what it's gonna taste like just by looking at it. I'm interested, is this like a baked thing inside of a... Baked good. 
Like good. Wait, has this got a special way to open as well? You're like the master at opening things, dude. I it's like, they've got such out. a unique way of doing it. <laughs> me, all right, forget it. It's oh, got wait. Like, pictures of squirrels and shit in there. Oh, it's got a little text bubble. It will e be easier to I... open if you cut the perforations at the four corners of the box. I would be happy if you could feel relieved with the pie fruit. That's what she said. Why the fuck would it have an explanation of how to open the box inside the box? It literally opened the box and it says, this is how to open the box. <laughs> I think it's trying to tell you how to open that. I would be happy. Oh, what the hell? I thought it was like- If you felt- Hang on a- Hang on a fucking second. Did it not, in Japanese, say that this is what the thing looked like? No. It said that is what the taste I, looks like. This is false fucking advertising, mate. Look at that thing. Wait, what? How the fuck does this equal this? Wait. It's nothing. It doesn't even look like it. Wait, no. Wait, hold up. They can get away with it by putting in small text saying that this is a visualization uh. of the taste. So it's not saying like, this so, is how delicious it is. It's saying this isn't what's in the box. They're showing you a fat ass peach pie, but the thing inside is just a little cookie. That's, That's bullshit. Actually and taste so good. Second of all, these are like beautifully cooked little baked things. You can see the taste because you're getting tricked by eating whatever the f this is and it tastes like that picture. Gabby, call the poison hotline. I don't want a f***ing Oreo. Come try this. <laughs> this little thing is going to taste like this. Promise? Mm. You have to look at it in order to get the taste. There's a picture of it, like of the actual little biscuit right there. Yeah, I didn't see that. I thought it was just a little I didn't little see it thing. either. What the f*** is this? Oh, I like these things. They have these little jelly packets in every convenience store. Tastes like a thigh? <laughs> what? That's what it says. It tastes like a thigh. Maybe James Charles thigh or something like that. Ready? Here we go. Okay, that's more like mush jelly. It's not chunky jelly. It's like someone literally punched the shit out of the packet. That really tastes good, dude. It's, it's the consistency of snot, dude. <laughs> Yeah, that's really good. You are ruining my day. <laughs> I can taste it. What the f man? That tastes good. Come on, shrimp. You gotta redeem yourself before we end this video. What the f are you doing, bro? <laughs> You're a sick, twisted I've individual. I've discovered it. I found it. No, you haven't. 10 out of 10. It's done. This video is over. It's done. Japanese snacks. <laughs> Japanese snacks with Josh and Eddie. If you want to see us travel to another part of the world and claim the flights on business expenses just so we can <laughs> eat some snacks in front of you guys, let us know in the comments. You fucking ruined Japanese snacks for me today. You know what? You're just jealous because you can't taste things like I do. I don't ever want to taste things like you do. I enjoyed today's video, actually. I did. <laughs> I need a tissue. You need a shower. That's Thanks it. for watching, everyone. Go to the boys at the store and buy stuff. Oh, okay, that was a bad idea. Yeah, you f***ed it. I'm covered in shit. Shit. Okay. I hate this country and their weird toilet snacks. Okay.